Hey everybody, it's BJ from Yard Breather Outdoors. Hope you've had a great week. Um, I'm sure we're all in agreement that uh, success in hunting and fishing isn't necessarily always measured by filling tags and getting limits. Um, sometimes we find success in the ability to be able to spend time with friends and family and uh, you know, enjoy a nice cup of coffee on a cold October morning. Uh, you know, also, uh, maybe put ourselves in a situation where we have something happen that creates a story that we can tell for years and years to come. Excuse me. And what I'm about to show you is no exception. Um, two years ago, November 2016 to be precise, um, I was waterfall hunting on some property I have access to here in Wisconsin and um, found myself crossing paths with uh, you know, an animal I would uh, come to know as uh, Big Daddy. Before you guys get into the video here, I'm going to warn you, I get a little excited, I use some colorful language, so if you got little ears around, or you're at work, or you're at church, you're going to want to turn the volume down. Uh, but here it is, enjoy. Hey Bill, you see this fucking deer? I'm out duck hunting this morning and this motherfucker shows up. Do you ever have a big ass deer walk into your decoy spread? This is crazy. Now get out of here so I can shoot some ducks. I'm talking to you. decoys and you're jacking everything up bro <laughs> I think I need to go buy an archery license hey guys I have to say that in my years of hunting and fishing up to this point that's probably the coolest thing I've come across up to this point um, it's a little uh, more story uh, Going forward from the situation, uh, as soon as, as I got home, I got a hold of the farmer and talked to him on the phone. Uh, initially, I had asked only for permission to hunt ducks and geese and do some predator hunting on his property. Uh, but I called and asked him and I said, hey, do you mind if I do any bow hunting or hunt the nine day gun season on that property? Uh, to which he said no because the sun was gonna on that property, which we're only fine with that as outdoorsmen, you know, we need to respect the wishes uh, and the property of the property owners. You gotta keep the, the good relations going. Anyhow, um, fast forward to the New Year's Day after I had that conversation, I stopped out there to drop some things off to the farmer's home and ran into their son. And talking to him, um, he had not hunted that property actually. Um, and he said, oh, you're the guy with the video. You wouldn't mind have uh, if I have a look at that? And I said, yeah, I happen to have it on me. And I showed it to him, he got a big kick out of it. Um, he did also tell me that, to his knowledge, there were no large bucks harvested in the area. Um, I predator hunted uh, after uh, the first of that year, uh, saw plenty of deer, saw some respectable bucks, but I did not see Big Daddy after that. So, um, and I never saw Big Daddy before I saw him that day either. So, uh, for all we know, Big Daddy could still be running around out there. But be that as it may, um, that, was, that was pretty cool. Hey, thanks for checking out the video. We got some more stuff uh, coming up. Um, if uh, you're just coming across this for the first time, subscribe to my uh, videos, subscribe to my page. We got some stuff coming out. We're going to do some hunt, we're going to do some fishing, we're going to do product reviews. We've got some how to's. Um, we're going to try and get out and do some, uh, some uh, trout fishing on the ice in the next day or two. Um, also, if you ever uh, wanted to take a trip out to North Dakota to go uh, waterfalling, I've got a how-to video coming up and it's going to be how to plan these things because if you're planning on going out there this fall, now is the time to start doing your research and getting your things together. And I've got some things, some tips I can hand you uh, that uh, they don't tell you uh, for a lack of a better term. So stay tuned for that. Thanks for checking in and have a great week guys.